This mug was given to me by my Connect group from my church back in Sydney and it's very special to me. It's coming with me wherever I go, just like how God is with me wherever I go. Who wants a strawberry head? I just spent the majority of the day emailing lots of schools in the area and doing paperwork and stuff so that hopefully I can start working here next week. I haven't officially been booked, but I've gotten contacted 11 schools, so hopefully they can have my name on their list. And since I've been inside at my computer doing boring stuff all day, I'm just going to go to the beach for a little while. All right, I've arrived at Kelly's Beach, which is a beach I haven't been to yet. But before I get out of my car, I have to put this on. I've already been eaten alive multiple times and I don't want it to happen again. So I'm gonna cover myself with this stuff. This is a lovely idea. Bless you, bless you, Ivy. Today is Saturday, which means that it's now time to go out and explore. Well, I don't actually drink alcohol at all, but since I'm in Bundaberg, I thought I would still explore the place properly anyway. So this morning I watched Church Online from Sydney and because we don't have daylight saving up in Queensland, I watched it at 8.15am. This evening I went to one of the local churches. I'm 
getting better at it. So on Friday, I emailed a whole lot of schools in the area to let them know that I'm available for casual work for the next three weeks. And today I'm going to be driving around to as many of those schools as I can. I've got a list of 10 or 11 schools, so I've just been to the first one. Well, I'm only halfway through my list. I've been to five schools, but I've already got work for Wednesday. Today's Monday, so in two days time. And I'm going to call it quits for today because it's 2 p.m. So schools will be finishing soon and I need to have lunch. <laughs> All right, quick update. Um, change of plans. I don't quite know what the next plan is. There are a few ideas what I can do, but basically, even though I got an email months ago that seemed to be saying that I had approval to teach in Queensland, apparently I don't. And there's more paperwork and stuff that I have to fill out, and I did some of that today. Um, but apparently it's going to take weeks to go through, and by then it could be the summer holidays. So, looks like I'm not working at that school on Wednesday or anytime soon, which is very frustrating. Look who's the queen of the castle this morning. Oh, are you jealous, Willow? You can climb on top of the other one. Willow. Oh, you're getting all the attention this morning, are you, Ivy? Willow. Yes, hi, Ivy. You can't eat a phone, okay? It's not edible. Willow. Oh, yes, hello, Ivy. You're the star this morning, aren't you? All right, so here's what's happening. I'm going to be moving back down to New South Wales, probably just the top part of it, because I still have approval to teach there. So I've booked an affordable Airbnb for the next three nights at Caboolture, which is near the Sunshine Coast. I was kind of disappointed that I didn't really see the Sunshine Coast on my way up. I went to the Big Pineapple, but that was pretty much all I saw of the Sunshine Coast. No beaches or anything. I was only there for about 30 or 40 minutes or so. So I'll get to catch up on what I missed of the Sunshine Coast for the next few days. And then I'll probably head down to the Tweed or somewhere like that, where again, I missed on my way up and work there for a little while and then see where it goes from there. Um, there kind of isn't really that much in Bundaberg anyway. I've kind of seen most of Bundaberg in the almost two weeks that I've been here so I guess it kind of feels like it's time to move on anyway but move on to somewhere where I can actually get some work and still explore a bit while I'm there anyway and hopefully the rest of this vlog will be a bit more interesting than the first half where I've just been talking about looking for work and getting work and then not being able to get work hopefully it'll be a lot more interesting seeing my explorations of Caboolture and the Sunshine Coast. 